This is the Chevy Silverado 1500. The vehicle has a 5.7 liter engine with 155,000 miles. Let's take you right here. It's not very noticeable, but there is a small dent here. Uh, there's no chips in the paint from it though, so that's good. The paint is in good condition. However, I'll show you a spot over here. It looks as if the vehicle was buffed in a few places and the whoever was buffing burned through the paint and then it looks like they touched it up, sanded it down and buffed it again as you can see right in this area. Also there's another small spot right here and then there's actually just one more spot that we'd like to show you. You can see right here looks like there is a paint, a bit of paint fail that somebody touched up right here. Let's show you the bed of the truck. You gotta pull the latch a little hard. As you can see very clean bed. Let's show you the inside. As you can see, the seat is in excellent condition. I don't see any rips, tears, no cigarette burns. As well as the headliner here, you can see that is very clean. It's not sagging down, there's no burn holes. Let's show you, uh, let's start up the engine now. And as you can hear, the radio is working. We're going to shut that off for now. The engine started up with no issues. Let's take a look inside the engine bay. As you can see, very clean engine running very smooth now before we take it for a test drive we're going to check our lights let me put my dealer plate in the back so we don't get stopped uh, lights turn signal Our, turn, our left turn signal and running lights are running are working. As well as the rear running lights and our left rear left turn signal. And put the head high beams on and our right turn signal. As you can see, the high beams and the right turn signal is working. And so is our rear right uh, blinker. So that's good. Let me turn the wheel. We'll show you the tire. As you can see, the tire has good tread left no problems passing inspection for your tires you might not need tires for a while I'll show you the rear here let's get on this side As you can tell, see, all four tires are good to go. Let's hop in here. Mm -hmm. 
horn works and like we said earlier radio works however it does sound like it's only coming out of the left side speaker let's try a reverse gear no issues with reverse no problem shifting into drive and also as I shifted from park to reverse and then into drive I didn't feel any jumps in the transmission it feels like it shifted very smoothly and as I'm driving right now it feels the, I don't feel any hesitations in the engine it's driving very smoothly That noise you just heard, that was the dealer plate falling over. I'll just put that down. driving it feels like it's it's driving very smoothly when you when I hit the bumps it doesn't feel like it's hitting hard also I'm not sure if you could tell but the steering wheel does feel like it needs to be aligned a little bit it's not pulling to the left or right but the steering wheel is turned to the right very slightly to uh, drive straight. Also the brakes feel very good, no issues with the brakes. A few more things I want to point out here on both doors, you can see that somebody put in an aftermarket uh, cup holder which looks very sturdy. And then the last thing I want to show you is the undercarriage here. You can see it looks very clean and intact. I'll show you on the other side. As you can see, no rust. Very clean. And the very last item I'd like to, you can see here, we've got the original books that it came with, as well as, give me a second here, as you can see, the original purchase sticker, still with the vehicle, that's very rare that you'll ever find one still with the vehicle. Okay, well that was the review of the Chevy Silverado 1500 with the 5.7 liter engine. I hope this has answered any of your questions and enjoy.